Hey, welcome back everybody. It's great to be with you. Uh, as you can see, I think maybe this is the first video I've ever done with a coat on. Uh, it's, it's actually feeling like winter for the first time in, in North Carolina. I think it's about 35 degrees out here. I know uh, everybody who's filming this is freezing as well. Uh, but the reason we're out here, and I don't know if you can tell where I am, I'm actually in the space that's between the Wheeler Center and uh, Raphael Arthur Hall. And the reason I'm here is to uh, share some really exciting, great news with you. Uh, I just came from a Board of Trustees meeting and the board unanimously approved uh, going forward with building two brand new residence halls and a sports complex. Uh, so thank you, Jesus. Uh, that, that, that is an awesome, uh, you know, just accomplishment for the college and the community. And I appreciate everybody's input. Uh, I know that students, faculty, staff, alumni, monastic community, uh, everybody was able to give their input to this and uh, thoughts on the design and those kinds of things. Uh, they're beautiful. When you see the image, you're going to see this building, you're going to think that's the whole thing. That's just one of the buildings. There's two of those. Uh, one will be parallel. They'll be here on my right and there'll be one on my left. Uh, the, right now the apartment's over here just to give you some perspective. This will be cleared out and this is actually going to become a quad. Uh, it's going to be really beautiful and the master plan in the future has this quad eventually going all the way down and extending down uh, to where the, the saints are now. Uh, and there'll be additional probably three or four residence halls along this quad. The Wheeler Center will probably get expanded at some point in that master plan. Uh, the dining hall will get expanded and uh, probably have a, a student union built into that in terms of uh, an expanded dining hall as well. But uh, the excitement right now is two new residence halls. And then I have to tell you, for those that have been around for a while, I have been talking about a sports complex for probably the last eight years. Uh, we came very close a couple of times to getting it done. And uh, I'm going to say thank you, Jesus, again, because it's going to happen. Uh, it's going to be an artificial turf field, eight lane track, stands, lights, uh, and there's going to be a field house. Uh, so it is awesome. It's exciting. And it's all due to be completed and ready by fall of 23. So uh, it's going to happen pretty fast. Things are going to start to develop. The sports complex is going to be right next to Alumni Field. So Alumni Field runs this direction and then right past it, almost connected to it, will be the sports complex. So again, really exciting news. Uh, thank God, say your prayers and uh, thank, thank uh, him and our Blessed Mother for her intercession and for making all this possible. So uh, I'm not going to add much more than that. I'm just going to say it's uh, really an exciting time. Uh, obviously a happy new year to you. We start school on Monday. We're in person. Uh, we're back to as normal as can be despite all the things that are going on in the world. And uh, I think we'll continue to uh, thrive and, and move forward and, and succeed as we have in the past two years. So. Uh, look forward to seeing you, those that are coming back on campus soon. And for those of you that haven't visited in a while, I hope you will. And until I see you, take care and God bless.